Still to come, we tried to persuade Alex James to love the food he hates, and Anjum Anand completes her three-course Indian feast with her effortless modern take on a go-in dessert. Alex James. Squid. I'm with you on this. Never eat anything that looks like an anemic tongue. Look at that. <laughs> it's not attractive, is it? Why do you hate it? Where do I start? They change colour, for goodness sake. Yeah, that's one thing. What if they lived on land? It'd be terrifying. I mean, they're fine on Doctor Who, yeah. but um, on my plate, no thanks. Is it the texture? <laughs> Rubbery, chewy, tasteless. Not my thing. OK. Rubbery, chewy and tasteless. So we've got a little competition for you. Now, each of our very fine chefs here have all conjured up a recipe using your least favourite thing in the world. And you know you're going to have to eat one of them at the end of it. You don't get a say in it, though. Our lovely diners are going to choose for you. So you're all ready for this. Diners are ready. Um, let's start with you, Matthew Tebbit. What you got under there? I've got the <laughs> squid. <laughs> all that stuff. Squid and um, pancetta. A little bit of chicory and red wine and coriander dressing. I think it's fab. What do you think? <laughs> should, go, should go nicely with the maggot cheese. <laughs> it's it not your, grabbing you. It'll yeah? cheese with maggots in it. But, but not by a squid. You've hidden it under the bacon. That's <laughs> so, what you do when you have kids, isn't it? You hide it so they don't hiding know it's the in exactly. Well, that's what I thought. Actually, it smells very nice. It does smell yeah? very nice. That's okay. the bacon. And John, what have you got? <laughs> okay. So I think if you don't like squid because it has no flavour, then you have to have a go at the South Indian version, Ooh. which has chilli and garlic and coconut, and it's quite Completely fresh and lightly it. cooked. <laughs> no, it just enhances the flavour <laughs> of the subtle fish. Yeah, well, I do. That looks very good. Smells good. South Indian yeah. squid. OK, excellent. Aaron, what you got well, hiding under there? Oh, hello. What's he going to do? Stuff yeah, but I'm, I'm disguising it, but in a different way. Because okay. you can still see it squid. But if you do it like no! this... <laughs> it's the little legs! Well, <laughs> <Take it away. laughs> you like fish and chips, right? We've got a nice batter. I think when it comes out fresh from the fryer, it's nice and crispy. And you've got some nice chilli jam here. Homemade chilli jam. That should cover it up. Which is, <laughs> you know, you're thinking about cheese, chutney, jam, you know, <laughs> spiders, squid. Bosh, Where are we going with that? <laughs> OK. Can OK, Alex, it? if you had to choose one of these dishes as your final meal, which one would you go for personally? <laughs> See, I must say, they do all look good, apart from that one. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even say it. Oh. <laughs> okay. I think this looks, like this looks, this looks <laughs> the nicest, actually. So, Diners, can I get you to raise your forks for Matt's sautéed baby squid with bacon, red wine and coriander? OK, so that's four for you, Matt. <laughs> okay. Not bad, not bad. Um, Anjum's coconut and chilli squid. Two. Two. Surprise. Not great. Surprise. Oh, you're evil. <laughs> <laughs> Aaron's tempura squid with chilli jam. Okay. Eight. Yeah. It's clear. It's a chilli jam. Eight. Do you want it with the little leggies or without the little leggies? Come on, I want to try it. It's a big evil lot. Got a, a big dollop of chilli jam in there, right? Yeah. Come on. Jam. So that, that, this is like the bit of the, the exactly. face, he's like the, the ood yeah. bit. Why don't you go for that little bit then? <laughs> right, get it straight in. No, go for that bit. No, I want to taste it. I want to taste really? it. Really? No, right. I'm sure. You, you tell me it's good. I'm sure it is. <laughs> it's really good. Nice. Fish and chips. Well done. Would you Very eat it good again? Then? Sure. <laughs> Well, look at that. I, I might be a while finishing this one. <laughs> Carry on, my darling. <laughs> Here's what else is still to come. Oh, pop a little. Pop a little. Where are the wiggles from? Just so I get them <laughs> oh, the, the wiggles are the heart and soul of Australia, so they're just from everywhere. So, <laughs> yeah, the wiggles, I think, are from Sydney. So, basically, this is a blend of Chardonnay and Viognier. So, the two grape varieties blended together. Now, when you're looking for value for money, sometimes blends, which get frowned upon a bit in certain parts of Europe, are, are great great value for money because it means that you can sort of spread a particular variety that's not like so popular a little bit further, isn't it? Well, I'm not fussed on that, I have to say. Not fussed on no, that? What about you, Alex? That's more it's not a disaster, one, though. Actually. It's not a disaster, no. <laughs> now, the last one. It might not seem like a bargain at 9.99, but when you consider Pinot Noir is an, ex an incredibly expensive grape variety to produce and really difficult mm. to get right as well. Burgundy in France is the spiritual home. Outside of that, New Zealand's probably had the most success That's with it. Good. There's I parts of the Yarra Valley, well. which Yarra Valley is just down here, Go just on. east of Melbourne, about 40 minutes. Okay. Well, this is de Bordelis, and they excel in making great value Pinot. That's so really it's nice. got all those yeah, things you, really you want. It's yeah. got the 
sort of the strawberry, the raspberry, the, the dark cherry, you get lovely spice, so cinnamon, nutmeg, clove, really silky texture, it's which quite, you want in it, Pinot. It's quite acidic. Tannin. Do you lose yeah. that? When you get Pinot, it's quite cool climate, so you'll naturally get a little bit more acidity there, but it's it's fine skin, so it's very silky. You don't get a lot of tannin. Have you got a favourite there, Alex? Um, the Pinot. The big fat one. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty it's good, monster, isn't, it? isn't it? Yeah, yeah. delicious. Aaron, what's your favourite? Uh,